Hey. Now before I get started, I'm just gonna say sorry um for the lack of video last week. Basically, I'm a complete twat. What I did, I did the video, took me half an hour ish, had to edit it, took me about an hour, and then by that time it was like midnight, so I uploaded it around about midnight, um and then when I actually realised it had uploaded, I noticed it was blank and it was a bit late to do anything about that. So I'm sorry for that, but um, hopefully today I'll make up for it. Or well, you could just go to my channel. Today isn't the best of days, it's been raining as usual. It's a bit grey, so I thought I'd have a grey day. I'm wearing a grey top, grey jeans and grey underwear. Never thought that would happen, did you? We actually got to set a challenge for once. So, why not grasp the opportunity with both hands and lift it in the air? Now, the challenge was to find a childhood poem book or something. And I can only find this. Football fever, also known as soccer fever. Basically, it's poems about football, because it says on the front. Um, cost me £5, this did, when I was about 10. It's probably my pocket money wasted on this poem book. So I, I've just got the shortest one there. Let's do this! If the world is a football spinning around in space, then who was it who kicked it there in the first place? Completely missed the desk there. I, I just picked it up. So the world hasn't ended yet, as far as we can tell. We could have been sucked up by a black hole and then spat out. But we're in a different universe. But no one's actually noticed yet. But we weren't actually supposed to die tomorrow, um, because that's when they just press the button to make it go oh, the the particles and molecules and they just they just launch them to spin round. But they don't actually let them clash until next month. But anyway, my pointless life can continue. I was just sitting there yesterday thinking I have wasted my life completely because I don't do anything worthwhile. But I, I am 15 now, so got the big GCSEs coming up, which are the main exams to get you a job. But today is the 11th of September, which you all know is 9/11. If you could just have a minute silence after the video, if you haven't already, or maybe you want to have another one, that'd be good. Because today we didn't have one at school, so. But it's just a day to remember stuff. Remember, I got a camcorder, and to remember that you should help the world, you should help people. You should help people if you could. We're watching a film at school where this kid has been set an assignment to help people. Just randomly, just help people. And it would be good if you could do that. And then we got we got set the assignment, and I, I said I was going to cook dinner for my nan. If that does happen, I will inform you. But as you can probably tell, I'm the worst cook. Ever. I'm gonna go now and go have my one minute silence. Um, come join me if you want. Just to think of what happened and how the world can just stop because of one thing happening in the world. I'm not, I want to set you a challenge though, um, and that challenge is help someone, be kind to someone, say something nice about someone. Obviously, I want to see it. Maybe you could just do the washing up. So your mum doesn't have to, or, or something generally from your heart, like I'm going to do for my nan. Good luck, insert five people here, and I see, you, I see you next week, where I'll be in a different location. I just, I'm just in the office because it has a spinny chair. See you next week, I'll be back, just for you. Just for you lovely people who I love. Love you so dearly, if you took my heart and dissected it, you'll see... Your name's written in it. But today it's all good in the hood. 